Today I want to talk to you about some people who are just a little mixed up about Christmas. You see, this weekend in Columbus, the Ku Klux Klan erected a cross in front of the State House. The Klan said the cross was a symbolized Christmas. <laughs> when I heard that and saw this video, I realized you Klan guys get confused very easily, don't you? I mean, first off, when you guys go to a sweltering hot summertime rally down in Georgia, on top of all your clothes, you'll wear long robes and hoods. But in December, when you're putting up your Christmas decorations in the middle of the night, and it's obviously so cold that you have to wear your mask just to keep your face warm, you still don't have the sense to put on your little white mittens. What are you thinking? The other thing is, you said the cross was meant to symbolize Christmas. <laughs> you clan guys just don't seem to get it, do you? Apparently, you don't remember the story of Christmas. Well, gather around the TV and I'll tell you again. Don't worry. I'll tell it slow so even you can understand. You see, Christmas is to celebrate the birth of Christ. Christ wasn't born on that cross, you hood-wearing goofs. He was born in the manger. That's why everybody else, besides you that is, uses the manger to symbolize Christmas. Well, I hope this has helped you clan guys understand what most five-year-olds have known for years. This is Michael Flannery, Channel 9 News. Happy Holidays.